over here at a grocery store called Joe V. And Joe V is one of the stores in Houston. And uh, there was, first of all, there was a line out the door to get in. Like, uh, they were letting people in one by one by one. And then I see something like that. It's completely empty. Like, I think that's uh, uh, milk. Oh, no, those are eggs. This place is sold out of eggs completely. So, <laughs> this is insane. Like, just looking at it. Um, trying to see if I can get some last minute supplies but it looks like everybody else has the same idea it's like uh, absolutely crazy like I'm still having trouble con comprehending this, like this is actually happening like, this is so mind-blowing you know like this is really 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 happening I'm gonna pull it back and oh crazy. going backwards backwards so I came to the bread aisle and look at this shit like, I'm glad I'm documenting all this because, because look, it's completely empty. Like, there's absolutely nothing in the shelf. Like, what are people supposed to eat? <laughs> like, everything, literally everything is sold out. Um, I'm trying to figure out what I want to get. But, um, yeah, I don't want to just grab a bunch of snacks. I want to get some for my family and uh, my girlfriend's family. So I got a whole bunch of onions and a whole bunch of tomatoes. As much as though it was like reasonably possible, I didn't want to clear out everybody else's, you know. Uh, yeah, I gotta be courteous because my mom told me that we don't have to worry, we can survive for like a month with the food because we're Indian and Indian people know how to conservatively eat. So that's an amazing thing, right? And uh, I don't know, like it's just so crazy thinking about how many people are right here trying to buy something. And I'm gonna see if they even have bath tissue. I doubt they do, but let me see. I don't need none though, because we use bidets. I know how to use a bidet. Okay, looks like they do have toilet paper. Um, but there's like a lady who's handing it out. I have one roll at a time, it looks like. All toilet paper, limit two. <laughs> so this whole section is just cleared out. Like, I know how this is when people have uh, hurricanes. The fact that hurricanes happen in Texas all the time, and we're used to this, but just imagining this is happening every single place, every single place in the whole entire world. I gotta go and grab some pet food so I can make sure my cats have enough to eat. They're out. It's gone. I just heard someone else saying it's gone, like there's nothing. And look at that. Something is completely gone. What is that? That uh, looks like laundry detergent. The laundry detergent is completely out. So, I need some pet food. I need to grab some cat food. And make sure. I feel really dirty in this place, man. Like, there's no way I, could, I feel comfortable right now. Just with uh, how many people are here and how fast this shit's traveling. I'm gonna grab some cat food. Hello. All right, they got some cat foods. They got some good stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, that looks like a dog food. I don't know if there's cat food. Yeah, there is. Okay, cool. Got it. Supposedly stores are closing. Supposedly they're gonna be completely closed for a little bit, but I don't know that for a fact, you know? I really don't know that as a fact. So, okay, I think I'm just about good. I got a little bit of stuff. Honestly, I'm like really, really, really shocked because like, I don't know what to get. Like, I came here with the purpose of getting, getting some supplies, but they're like, I'm so in shock. I don't even know what I need to get here. So it's like a little mind blowing and I can always get some almond milk, but I gotta go back to work and I gotta make sure that uh, I can actually store some of this stuff. So I'm just gonna chill out and I think I got a lot of what we need right now. So got onions, got tomatoes, and uh, just gonna pray for the best, you know? So I'm out. Peace.